Okay, so this is my review of Toma Farce 4 by Frog God Games. Um, I have to say, for the most part, I'm kind of disappointed. Um, so this, I'm going to try and make it a review of the book itself, but also the things that I'm very disappointed in. Um, First off, I like his I like um, McFan's art. I question whether he can carry a full book though. Um, I don't know. Some things look very cool, and other things look really funny. Um, if you were to put me up against page thirty-three, the chick or chikey um, alligator guy, I think we would laugh and just kill it. What a silly picture. Um, some of them are like that here. Several gripes. Number one, the PDF which came with the book, when you bought the book. I don't know what it is about the PDF, but it is so horribly slow, and it doesn't matter what device it's in, I've re-downloaded the PDF, it's the PDF. It's slow, it's like it's a giant, and actually, you know, it's, it's even slower than it is so slow, it seems slower than a Pathfinder PDF. <laughs> I mean, it is freaking slow. Um, that kind of bothered me. So, I didn't really look through it a lot. I, you know, I was just waiting for this book to come in. Um, the selection of monsters. I understand. You know, you're running out of things to come up with. But these are... Some of these are really, you know, let's see how many golems, types of golems we can come up with. Oh, but don't worry, because I know in the other Tome of Horrors, there was at least ten other golems in there, too. So, that kind of got me. Um, back to the art, though. The PDFs are very bright and detailed. Uh, case in point, like page 34, actually 30. Three, the Gator guy is a good example of this too. But 34, the Chosen of Lilith. You look at the PDF, you look at the book. The PDF is bright, detailed. The book is muddled. Muddy, dark. Um, it is pretty much the way it looks right there. I mean, it is just dark. You lose almost all the detail. You can't see it hardly anywhere. Really. I mean, you can you kind of see it, but it's so dark. Um, I don't know if that's the printing process or if that is his art. Um, because you look at some of these other things, and they look very detailed and very bright, and then other things look very dark. I would say probably at least half of the art in here. It's just muddy dark. You just can't tell. It just looks like a big blob or something. Really horrible. Very, very horrible. Um, another gripe I have is the. I don't know. You know, it doesn't really look so bad, the, but it is. The ends are completely crushed. Um, it came in a very minimal shipping. Um, and yeah, I expect my, um, what was I just, I just bought something and it came, oh, the Osric book. That thing was packed away like Fort Knox, came in perfect condition. Not this one. Um, that upsets me. I'm not really upset by the price, though, you know, it is a smaller book, but still over 200 pages, so you know, but it is a smaller book. Um, I just, it's a bad combination. And I think what, I think what I'm seeing here a lot of times is when Frog God goes on and does its own thing, it does really good. But when it tries to do something that crosses over for Pathfinder, they fuck it up. Or at least it's not as nicely done, or there's always something that you can, a lot of times you just can't pander to two different audiences. Sometimes you got I don't even think it's pandering to a certain audience. I think it's just doing their own thing. 
Um, I don't know. I question, I wonder about that. I, I wonder if um, the Pathfinder people had something, some kind of say in who was doing the art and whatnot. See here, the fucking horse. It just looks like a black. And I'm not. That's not an exaggeration at all. And I understand. Oh, it's an ebony pony, which or ebony horse, I guess. But it's just. In the PDF, it had a lot more detail in it. I just, wow, what a disappointment. Um, it's okay. I will eventually pull it out and use it. You know, um, and actually, there's a few on there. You know, the unique monsters, I know there's at least one. There's a devil that's unique, a unique devil in here. He has a very interesting write up. But a lot of this stuff is just so. Oh, a wolf, a war wolverine. Yeah, yeah. Very disappointing. 